Hello all, this is James Johnson, aka Software Blade, and I am here in Pumpkin Days. Uh, the point of this video is basically going to be uh, kind of a how to get yourself off to a quick start guide. Um, I see some comments in the forums of the game, how do you make money? Uh, how do you get a good start? How do you make your own tools? And I've already done a tutorial about how to make tools, but Of course to make tools you have to have certain equipment you have to have the the sawing station you have to have the anvil So on and so forth and those things are slightly expensive and you don't start the game worth very much money, so What I'm gonna do here is kind of a min maxing thing um, I've thought about different strategies to get off to the fastest start possible, and I have an idea in my mind, and that's that's what we're gonna we're gonna go about seeing what would a min maxer like start look like in Pumpkin Days. Hmm. I didn't even get to... Oh, here it is. All right. And how about October like 21? Go with salt. All right, salt is going to stop start in Pumpkin Vale. And again, what we're going to be doing here is we're we're going to try to utilize the time as efficiently as we can. Hello, sir. Let's, uh, yeah. We're going to take the river line. Sure, infinity farm sounds good. Alright, and so we're off and running. Um, 9 o'clock is when people are going to start being in their stores. We got a little bit of time to do something else. I'm just going to run down here and grab a few flowers, basically. We're going to spend a lot of the day actually picking flowers because this is something you can do without expending
without expending your um, precious stamina. Alright, so I think that's all of the ones that are right down here in the immediate area. We'll run back up. I'm gonna go to the blacksmith and talk to the blacksmith because I want to get the the axe from him. Um, I'm gonna utilize the axe to basically utilize my stamina as quickly as possible to get money. Hombre. So we've done the blacksmith quest. So now I am going to keep an eye out for the collectibles as I head yonder this way. What? I should finish more tasks before... Oh! Damn them. Okay, so they're trying to... Force me into... Well, let's talk to her. Howdy! Alright, got some poop and whatnot. Uh, hopefully, that's enough tasks. Nope. Okay, this is this is ruining my methodology. I had thought up. I need to do before it'll let me out of town. What? Bonita. Alright, I don't know if that was... 
was a task, it might not have been. I'm gonna give it one more try here. We, we, we've done three tasks. I don't know, maybe I have to do all the tasks before it'll let me leave the, the property. Jesus. That's definitely going to make day one be a little tougher than it needs to be. Any flowers to pick here? No. Um... Should be able to talk to somebody here, I suppose. What's up? Talk to the angry chick at the post office, maybe it'll let me leave time. Jerk.
So yeah, the goal of my strategy is basically picking flowers. Let me leave town now. Yes, I think so. I should probably get some of this into my hot bar so I can make some room for stuff and things. And yeah, this is very low stamina. Doesn't use any stamina, actually.
Now this is kind of what I'm about to do here is kind of like this my secret weapon if you will. So the stamina I do have I want to convert that into as much money as I can as efficiently as I can and I thought that maybe fishing would be the way to do that but fishing takes too much time and I thought logging might be the way to do that and yeah logging is the way to do that but you need a specific tree um, different trees are worth different amounts of money and then there's some trees that are just well easier to cut down so we are heading to some specific trees because that's why we got the axe and these are the trees I'm talking about Five hits. Don't worry about the stump. That's a bum tree. That was a bum tree too. Okay, so <clears throat> anyway, um, so we did that. And we got the uh, the smoky wood, and there's a reason we're targeting the smoky wood. It's because it's worth more than the other wood types. So we're gonna head back towards the farm and toss this stuff into the the crate. Place down our bed and skip to the next day. <laughs> and see how our first day of basically a money focus went by just simply running around collecting flowers and uh, cutting down a couple trees for the purposes of just straight up selling the wood Oh, he's waiting here. Need a transfer all button. I'm gonna, I'm gonna even sell that. I'm gonna sell that. I'm gonna sell that. I could care about the table, milk, and I'm gonna keep the plank. Yeah.
nerd. All right, he'll have to wait till tomorrow. All right, we've woken all rusted and spry. We've left the boy sitting here all night. One of the most annoying things about this game is you can't actually manage to turn the music up. I literally have the music completely turned off in the uh, audio properties, but yet it plays whenever the heck it wants to, as loud as it wants to. We're gonna go see how our our day of attempting to make money went. Our very first day in the game, how much money did we manage to scrape together? Um, Ezekiel, he wants us to come talk about saving Martha, his pickaxe. Um, our quota for the mayor. And our first day. From the mayor, here's your payment for the last shipment, $1,700. So with $1,700 you can get yourself off to a very nice start here in this game. Uh, and yeah, that's, that's, that's how you go about running around making some quick money on the very first day, $1,700. Macamoles here in pumpkin days. Um, hopefully this video uh, gave you some ideas on how to go about uh, maximizing your time to collect as much money as possible in your own game. And now that you know how to acquire a decent amount of money right smack from the get-go, now you can purchase those things you've always wanted to purchase from Eddie so that you can make your own tools and everything else. Anyway, I'm Saul for Blade. I Hopefully you're appreciating my content. If so, please leave a like and subscribe. Until the next time, all... Peace.